A nonpartisan political ad, Fact Checker, says a new Mark Pryor spot you may have seen is mostly false. And now a nonpartisan fact checker of political ads says a new Mark Pryor spot you may have seen is mostly false. Mr. Pryor seems to have lost a bit of mo anyway with the Ebola ad. I mean, it was widely ridiculed as, as, as over the top. It kind of lend itself to fear-mongering mm -hmm. uh, by the, the, the prior campaign. And, and as you said, it, it just doesn't look good for the prior campaign. Right. Yeah, a little I'm, sweeter than what's happening in sweet. Arkansas right now, <laughs> where one politician is blaming another for spreading the e e Ebola you virus. Think it really can't is get that below worse? The, yeah, and then it gets worse. It gets worse. Senator Mark Pryor wow. of Arkansas is turning some heads <laughs> with his latest ad in one of the key battleground races this cycle. Take a look. The Ebola outbreak is worse and than anybody. The outbreak is, quote, vastly underestimated. Tom Cotton left. voted against preparing America for pandemics like Ebola. Congressman Cotton voted to cut billions from our nation's medical disaster and emergency programs. He was the only Arkansas congressman to vote this way. Just like he was the only one to vote against Children's Hospital. Instead, Cotton voted for tax cuts for billionaires funding his campaign. Rather than protecting our families. Good Lord. Oh my God. It's, first of all, it sounds so I mean, cheesy. come on. These Seriously, ads are terrible. Is this terrible. a Saturday Night Live ad?